Hello everyone, my name is Trooper, and welcome back to another video. Today I'm showing you guys how to install Radiance V version 2.1 into your LSPDFR. This is currently one of the trending mods on LCPDFR.com. It's not a brand new mod, but since it is trending, I thought I'd hop on here and do a video for you guys. I have done a video on mods very, very similar to this in the past. This is a newer version and a more updated version of better police lights that I've done a video on in the past. So I thought I'd show you guys how to install this as well. So obviously, it is a lighting enhancement notification. And do not worry, this shouldn't interfere with any graphics mods. If it does, make sure you guys do make a backup of your visual settings .dat so you can replace it if anything does go wrong. But it shouldn't. I'm not. Do not quote me on that. If it does, make sure you guys make a backup. Go ahead to download this file and then install the latest version available to you. Click here to speed it up a little bit more. Save it and open it on up. Once it's done downloading, go into the OIV installers folder and grab the correct oiv so for now we're going to be using this one right here the replace bright which is going to replace your visual settings dot that so grab that put it on your desktop and then just like any open iv or oiv file what you guys want to do is use your open iv and we're going to want to find our package installer so go to windows let it start up let it take you to your gta5 main directory and then when you're in here go to your open package installer click that find the oiv on your desktop which is right here, hit open, go to install, install into your mods folder, not into your game folder, put it into your mods folder. If you do not have a mods folder, then make sure you guys watch my video on how to make one because I do not recommend modding a game without one. It is a necessity for modding GTA 5. Install it to your mods folder, install and confirm installation, and it should be done relatively quickly. So in a couple of seconds, it should finish itself up. And there you go, you've now successfully installed Radiance V into your GTA 5 LSPDFR. I hope you guys did find this video useful. If you did, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Comment down below what videos you want to see next. Maybe LSPDFR tutorials, some different videos, maybe graphics mods and things like that. Just let me know down in the comments section. Also, be sure to check out the channel sponsor down in the description below Zap Hosting and use code Highway Trooper, no capitals and no spaces for 20% off all your server hosting needs. Other than that, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers and goodbye.